she believes that it's important to help families who still have not been able to find affordable insurance. Look, the Affordable Health Care Act did a world of good. And the 50-something efforts to repeal it that the Republicans have staged were a terrible mistake. We, for the first time in our history, at least, are providing insurance to more than 90 percent of our people. But there is a group of people, mostly small business owners and employees, who make just a little too much money to qualify for Medicaid expansion or for the tax incentives, who can't get affordable health insurance premiums in a lot of places. And the reason is they're not in big pools. I mean, it's not like they work for Safeway or General Motors or you name it, right? They did. So they have no bargaining power. So she has proposed to take the next step in this and do what the president tried to do the first time and she supported, which is to allow people 55 and over to buy into Medicare and allow others to have a public option that looks like the expansion of Medicaid they can afford. It's the right thing to do.